Well, hi you guys. I am making this video for you just to help you understand how grading happens in science class. It is a little bit different. We have three different categories and I'm going to go over those three categories. The first one is called must do's. Now must do's are going to be things that you must do on a daily basis. In order to get the basic understanding of what we are doing in science class for this grade level, um, you need to know, understand those must do's and be able to complete those must do's, hopefully with an 80% or better. 80% is our mastery level. So if you were to make 100, you could get, you would get 80%. So up to 80% will come from daily classwork and mastery checks. Those are our must do's. Mastery checks are going to be basically a small couple of questions at the end of each lesson to make sure that you understood and took away what you needed to understand from that lesson. Okay, so that's what a mastery check is. Right? And you'll have a couple times to try to make that mastery level um, so that you can actually take it a couple times, but you have to do that in class. Okay? Should do's. Should do's are assigned to you weekly. So um, on Fridays, you will have an assignment that is due by that Friday. Um, you can work on them in class, um, and in order to do that, you have to have finished your must do's for that day. Um, and be caught up to be able to work on your should do's, okay? So should do's are gonna be homework assignments that you can work on in class if you have those must do's that you have to do for the day done. Those are worth 15% of your grade. So, so far we're at 95, okay? The last 5% is going to be aspire to do's. So aspire to do's are basically where the must do's are giving you the basics, should do's are adding to your understanding and helping you understand it more. And aspire to do is basically, I want you to be able to teach it back to me because if you understand it, you should be able to teach it back to me. So for the aspire to do, on the last couple of weeks of the quarter, probably a couple weeks before the end of the quarter, this will be due, okay? You can work on this in class and you'll understand what they are as we go through the quarter. You'll know um, what your assignments are when you get your packets and when you get your information during the quarter. Um, but these you can work on after you finish the must do for the day and after you have completed all of the should do's. It is worth 5%. Do you see why you would do that last? You want to learn, learn and understand, get more understanding for these should do's, and then be able to teach it back to me for the aspire to do's. So 80, 15, 5%, all equals 100%. So remember that each one of those categories, if you made 100 on every assignment, then you would get the 80, the 15, and the five. But remember, we're not always gonna make 100 on an assignment, so it won't be perfectly 100. And remember, that's okay. Part of learning is making mistakes, and that helps you learn more. So hopefully that makes it a little clearer for you guys and helps you understand how we do grading in science here at VISTA.